everybody, it's Grace Grella, and as always, we're here to get you into the positive zone. So if you need information about your love life, your finances, your friends, your family, whatever it is, to put that mind of yours at ease and open up that heart and have you chillax, hey, that's what I'm here for. So if you're watching live, Call in the TV studio line. It's 516-629-3705 or 3715. Um, if you're uh, sending me questions via uh, Facebook, that's okie dokie too. All right. Um, and we're, we're gonna, just going to try to get to everybody. That's the way we roll here. It's all about you and making you happy and get you that positive 411 in your life. Now, tonight is tonight, tonight. It's like awesome night. We have Lisa Fazio, the one and only artist. Da -da -da -da. Yay, Lisa. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you so much for coming here. Thank you for having me. I am so blessed that you're here. Um, I'm so blessed that you called into the show a year ago when Terry Leone was my guest. And amazing. because of that, um, here you are. It's, uh, sure isn't it amazing, amazing how synchronistic the, the universe truly is, babe? And that you painted this gorgeous, wrote, that I'm devoted to St. Therese. Did you know that when no. you painted it? No. No, I haven't told you. Hey, St. Therese, thanks for, you know, thanks for whoop, whoop, representing up there for me. And um, that the, their roses, it's just perfect. It's a perfect fit. And beautiful, and I will always have it on my desk You're for welcome. all my shows. Thank you so You're much, welcome. Lisa. welcome. Thank you for having me. Your art uh, gift is heavenly scent, and so are you. And um, hopefully we can give Norma some heaven sent info. Norma, are you there? Hello? Yes. Hi, Norma. How can we help you tonight? Um, I don't know. I just have to call into the show, so I'll call you. Oh, okay. Just call into the show, and I'm just calling in. So, yeah, but you're a uh, Leo. Your birthday is August 12th? Yes. Okay, so um, uh, honey, uh, we're having some audio um, uh, feedback here. Can you turn down your uh, your device or your TV or however you're watching, please? Then I can't hear her answer. Okay, um, uh, you'll be able to, uh, to, can you hear me now? Yes. All right, so you can still hear me, so this is good. Um, okay. Uh, what it's just distracting honey I work by voice vibration so when I'm hearing that echo of, of the reverb or with the audio it throws me off and that's not good for you okay all right um, now um, there's something to do with uh, do you have the North Carolina uh, in your mind are you planning to go to North Carolina on a trip no uh, better write this down I see you taking a trip to the Carolinas this year calendar year 2017 and it looks lovely it looks like either that you're going with family or uh, family goes there and you're going to meet them there um, I get a really nice energy about this for you um, you've been a little too stressed out Leo's have had a lot of stress and tension in their life and um, especially around family has your family been kind of stressing you out honey my whole life what <laughs> my whole life. Your whole life they've been stressing you out? Okay. Um, all right. Well, I'm feeling it. Girlfriend, just saying, hey. All right. So um, I'm feeling this, and I, I do feel that now it's the, the release point is coming up. All right? Um, especially after uh, the eclipse on August 21st. It's like you finally doing the exhale and realizing, you know what, um, there's a plan. Heaven's got a plan, and you're going to see it and you're gonna feel a lot more relaxed. Like you don't have the weight of the world on your whole shoulders. Cause you're, Leo's always take care of everybody. You know that, right? Yeah. Yeah, I know, honey. That's what makes you a beautiful Leo. You know, everybody admires and respects your strength and um, your counsel and um, that crown that you're wearing on your head. We love it. Jenny Fleck, Jenny Fleck. It's about <laughs> you getting into uh, recognizing that, you know what, even Wonder Woman puts her cape in the cleaners from time to time. It's like give yourself a break, okay? Um, I do feel that this trip down south is going to be a much needed a refuel, recharge your batteries so that, you know, you can come back and be the, uh, the queen bee that you really are, all right? And I know Beyonce says that she's a queen bee, but so are you. 
Okay. No, Barbara Streisand was the original Queen Bee. <laughs> <laughs> Streisand, well, there you go. That's true. I can't argue with that. I, 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 I totally adore that woman. All right. Um, so it's about you uh, recognizing the, your stress with family and relationships. Going to chill after the 21st of August. You're going to be feeling better. There's going to be a little getaway trip for you, a little mental health break trip to recharge your batteries. All right. And um, I also want to say, um, now, do you have two children? Yes. You do? All right. Because um, their angels are showing me two children. They said, these are her angels. Okay. And um, they, uh, they're applauding you like you're a great mom, just so you know, FYI. All right. Okay. Um, and did you want to uh, treat them for a weekend away in August? Uh, no, they're grown. They have their own. Uh, All right, you but know, were you? Yeah, yeah but you know, they're always your babies, Mom. I don't care how big they get, how old they are. Your babies are your babies, especially I know, if you're a Leo. They don't, they don't. They don't feel that way. <laughs> I know, but you do in your heart of hearts. And so, and I'm, I'm talking to you. Don't make me do Robert De Niro. I'm talking to you. I'm talking to you. All right, um, it's about. To me? It's about your. Yeah. See, I knew you'd get it. It's about you um, acknowledging that even though they're grown, they're still your children, and that inner child still needs to be acknowledged in both of them. And um, so it's about you know what? Let's do something. Uh, and you were always that way when they were growing up. Let's a, a, a special surprise treat or uh, something to make them laugh or. Um, Leos are great uh, at recognizing that laughter and love are the two greatest healing energies in the universe. And so you would do something to make them laugh or a special uh, ice cream treat or whatever it was. It didn't have to be a lot of money. You always found a way. And so uh, the angels are acknowledging you for that. And so just be watchful. Next month is going to be very special for you, okay? Thank you. You're welcome. Thanks for calling in, honey. Have a great evening. Lots of blessings coming your way, Norma. Take care, honey. Oh, I love it when stuff like that happens. And, uh, you know, it's good to be the good news chick. And that's why I made the deal that I made. I, all right, I'll do this. I'll do this work. But I want to do it to empower people and make them happy and uh, introduce them to Lisa and her artwork and the potentials that they have for uplifting and healing their own uh, energy and soul through your work and your gift Thank and you. your love from above. Love from above. Yeah, baby. Phyllis, are you on the line? Hello? 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 Phyllis? Hi, this is Phyllis. Yeah, hey Phyllis, how can I help you? Um, I wanted to say I think Lisa's artwork is beautiful. Hello, Lisa. Hi. Hi I really like those roses, and I'm sitting here at home Aww. looking at roses that I have outside, thinking of how you guys were talking about nature and having faith. Mm -hmm. And then... My daughter is the one who said, Mom, we really want to attract some goldfinches to the garden. And I was skeptical. I didn't have faith. But she hung up a feeder that's special for the type of seed that goldfinches eat. And right this minute, they're out there eating and flying around. There you go. Listen, when some things are for the birds in a good way. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Just saying, girl. All right. And so this is uh, fabulous. And I know as a Libra, Phyllis, that um, you're all about beauty and uh, creating beauty. And uh, that's why I think you're so keyed into Lisa's energy here. And uh, definitely check out her website, um, Phyllis. I think uh, you'll be quite intrigued. And you might want to treat yourself with a, um, a soul portrait. Yeah, maybe. Definitely. I think that would be a perfect birthday present to yourself. Oh, that sounds good. All right. Well, thank you. I think you should go for it, girl. All right. Well, keep up the good work. It's always nice to hear what you're talking about. Oh, Phyllis, thank you so much. I appreciate it, and thanks for watching and calling in. Sure. Okay, good night. Have a good night, Phyllis. Right. That was she's sweet. adorable. She's sweet. a producer here. Oh, okay. is she? Yeah, That's adorable. Yeah, she, she does her own shows. She's, um, she's another one of God's uh, Earth Angels. Angels. Um, and she can sew. And she's like Martha Stewart on steroids. She's fabulous. <laughs> okay, but I know that she would resonate with your artwork and uh, having you do a soul portrait for her. Um, it would be a perfect uh, connect the dot. And I love when the universe allows us to do that for each other and uh, bring uh, connections and uh, 
put people where they need to be. You know, mm -hmm. it's like, oh, you know, hey, by the way, you should hook up with so and so because you know she's going to do a soul portrait for you that's going to heal your life and change it forever. Mm -hmm. You know. And that's what I just said to Phyllis. You know, you're going to do a her soul portrait, and it's going to heal her life and change her forever. So, I'm thanking you in advance for that. Okay, I'll, I'll remember that. <laughs> All right, we'll play to the tape again. Absolutely, next year. cut to the video. Okay. That's going to be my new shtick now uh, with Lisa. <laughs> and next year, this time, it's all about the month of July. It is. We're going to cut to the video tape, and so I can say, "I told you so." The so Aries in me loves that. <laughs> I told you. Do you believe me now? Okay. Well, you can relate to that. It's I can. very. Um, challenging air quotes sometimes uh, uh, being gifted with something and um, you know uh, being mocked for it or uh, uh, <laughs> ridiculed for it or uh, all, all, the, all those crazy things that I said look look it's you know it's my gift it's, I tried giving it back it's not refundable and you know forget about being out in left field I'm out of the ballpark okay <laughs> but in a good way in a good you know way. in a good way so when people feel and sense your energy and they know oh she's you know definitely uh, not from the dark side you know she's a good person <laughs> and it, it's all good um, it, it softens it and it allows them to open up to their own inner awareness and voice mm -hmm. um, because I take it seriously when a very famous rabbi said you know the kingdom of God is within you okay <laughs> so it's in there so listen to yourself listen to your heart listen to your soul listen to that that inner knowing and trust it you know it's um, uh, you with your work and you just do it so flawlessly Lisa I'm in okay. awe Thank you, you are just it's a blessing. I, I really wow. enjoy doing it. It's such an and what I like is there's different avenues in which I can touch people. It's not uh, for the piece that I made here. That's a message from Saint Teresa, and it, it involves my a love of watercolor, my love of flowers. So I'm able to give you the many different gifts on different levels that even please me as well. Yeah. So I I, lo I just love doing it. It's such an honor to be able. You know, back in the day, you know, artists, it's like you're going to starve. You know, I'm not. It, it doesn't have to be that way. As long as it comes from the heart and you really enjoy what you do, I think you attract people who Absolutely. enjoy getting what you. Absolutely, love attraction. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, you know. Um, <laughs> As you sow, so shall ye reap, right? So it's, an, it's a scientific axiom. For every action, equal and opposite reaction. Uh, karma, what goes around comes around. So there are many different, uh, a lot of different lingo going away, uh, going around about it and however you want to express it or verbalize it, but the energy remains the same. Mm -hmm. So it's in the giving that we receive. Mm -hmm. It's And make sure that what you're giving and what you're doing for others really is uh, from the heart and from goodness because that w is what will be reflected back to you. So when you focus on that, and it doesn't mean, and this cracks me up because people say, well, you know, Grace, I tried that, and this person's still an SOB and blah, blah, blah. And um, I, I laughed and I said, well, you know, maybe they're in a point of pain and transcend that and, and be a p in a point of healing and, and love and send that to them, all right? right and right, then it's right. not your circus, not your monkey anymore. Right, you right. Know? and also there's a timing factor. Just because at that moment they're not acknowledging it, it, it could be the healing could act later on. Oh, absolutely, mm -hmm. absolutely. You could call somebody a year later they're sitting right next to you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you <can. laughs> Sound familiar? Okay. All right, uh, Sheila, we got Sheila on the phone. Hello, Sheila, are you there? Yes. Hello, Sheila, I love your name, beautiful name. Oh, thank you, Grace. <laughs> <laughs> How can I help you? I'd like to find out if you see anything with my uh, business for this coming year and next year, how it's going to be progressing. Okay, babe. And um, uh, you are kind of on the cusp. Do you consider yourself a Virgo or a Leo? I'm more of a Leo. I have okay. more of the traits. Okay. <clears throat> All right. So, well, as a Leo, and I love my Leos, um, as a Leo, <laughs> you have to know you were born to rule. I mean, have your own business, be the boss. It's just the way God made it to be. <laughs> okay. uh, you, know, you, don't, you, you give orders brilliantly. Taking them, eat, not so much. That's okay? true. So <laughs> it's, it's about, um, unless you really respect and trust that person, then it softens it a little bit for you. Mm -hmm. But um, I want to say that you uh, being self-employed is the only way it could have happened this time around. Um, okay. And I do, f and I mean that in a good way. Yeah. All right. Uh, because there are very few people on this planet that you trust, Sheila. Mm-hmm. Okay. And because you have that inner vision like I do, 
Yes. And you know who you can trust and, and who isn't trustworthy. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. True. Yes, ma'am. So <laughs> I know because I'm on your wavelength, babe. So it's about um, it's um, <sighs> challenging for you. Sometimes, mm -hmm. um, I'll, I'll give you an example. My father would always say to me, Grace, you don't have to like the third baseman, but you need him to play the game. Right. And mm -hmm. that's how he would, he always used sports euphemisms or, you know, to explain yes. life to me. And mm -hmm. so you don't always have to like uh, the people that you're doing business with, Sheila, but right. they're just part of the process. And hopefully, uh, because Leah's always, you're regal, you're royalty, you know, they mm -hmm. have to ascend to your level. Okay? Okay, yes. And so mm -hmm. that's what you're doing. You're trying to raise them up. All right? Okay, yes. And um, it's that's been That's exactly right. Yeah, mm -hmm. I know. And it's been frustrating, especially the last three months. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes, yeah. Yeah, I mm -hmm. know. All right, good news is you're going in the right direction. There's going to be, you're thinking about, you have two businesses I'm hearing? Well, I have a few ideas, and I have one, but I have a few other ideas. Okay, one of those other ideas. You have one, and then you're going to have another. So you're going to have two. Mm -hmm. So, um, And uh, there is somebody that um, the universe is going to put into your path that's going to be a brilliant manager that you're going to trust that you can have manage one of them for you. Wow, okay. All right? Mm -hmm. um, you'll, so you'll start seeing this within the next three months, uh, so or before the end of October. Wow, right? okay. Um, there's another incorporation for you, uh, uh, um, and it's another write-off. There, there's a lot of financial boons uh, going to be coming with you uh, along with this. Okay. Yes. So mm -hmm. uh, uh, God bless you on that. I think it's going to be wonderful. And um, do you have a daughter in college? No, no, no. I have uh, two grown sons. All right. Who's got the daughter in college? that um, maybe is a, a close to you, like a sister or? Um, I have somebody that she has a son in college that I, she's, she works with me. We work together. Okay, and this, it's a, a son that's in college. Maybe there's going to be a, a daughter-in-law, but uh, she won't use the in-law. It'll be more of a daughter comes into her life. Oh, the daughter I always wanted. Oh, that's so funny because my son just got married and he married somebody that I keep saying is the daughter that I wanted. See? If I had a daughter, she would be it. Oh, mazel tov. So this Thank is, you. This, is um, <laughs> this is something that is going to happen for your friend as well. And so wow. um, see how blessed people are around you? It's yes. like that love is radiating and that experience is, uh, is going to be um, now p passed uh, along to the uh, woman that work, uh, works with you. Wonderful. Oh, yes. it's so great. I'm stumbling over my words. <laughs> <laughs> really? Thank it's you. not every day I see this. Okay? This is like awesome. You're awesome. Wow. You're awesome. Please Thank embrace you. your awesomeness. Okay? Thank think, you. Thank you so much. I think that's the theme. Um, for everybody watching, for uh, Jake Cooper, you're awesome. For uh, Yvonne uh, Cook, you're awesome. Terry Leone, you're awesome. David Lawrence Palmer, you're awesome. All wow. my friends that are watching, I know because I'm seeing you on Facebook. You're awesome and I love you. <laughs> Lois. Lois, I love you, Lois. Okay. Um, okay. And we have um, somebody else waiting online, Sheila, so Thank I have you. to say goodbye for now. But uh, get back to me and let me know, okay? Absolutely. Thank you so much. Oh, you're bye welcome. Bye-bye. Lots of blessings. Bye-bye. Bye. Is that Marianne on the line waiting for us? Hello? 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 Hello, Marianne? Yes. Hi, Marianne. Hi, how are you? Hi, how's it going, honey? How can I help you? Marianne on the line waiting for us? Oh, yes, I'm here. Okay, you need to turn down your audio of uh, however you're watching the show because there's oh. an echo, honey. Okay, I just turned it down. Oh, uh, woohoo! Thank you. And what's your question for me, Marianne? Um, I received an offer today for a job, and I'm just—it's been coming a while, and I just don't know what to do. And I thought perhaps you could help me out. <laughs> Marianne, the lovable Libra. Libras hate to make decisions. <laughs> Should I have chocolate? Should I have vanilla? Hey, I'll have vanilla fudge swirl. You know, it's, um, I know it's, but you know what? That's like your karma. That's like your destiny. That's like, so you can trust your own discernment to make those choices for yourself and to make the intelligent ones for yourself. And nobody's more intelligent than a Libra. Okay. Okay. So um, now are you in finance at all? No, I'm not. 
there's some uh, financial institution I'm seeing around you that's going to outreach uh, about needing a head of human resources. Uh, write that well, down. Marianne, write, just write it down. Okay. Okay. Um, is that somebody wants you to, uh, uh, personnel, human resources, um, uh, to resolve people's corporate issues? This is going to be a, an opportunity that's going to come your way before this year is over with. Okay. Um, the opportunity that you're currently asking me about, did they give you a deadline about two weeks? Yes. Okay. I just want to make sure I'm keyed in here. Yes. Thanks for the confirmation. I'm, I'm hearing that the deadline is two weeks and that, you know what, um, uh, this is something I think you're going to go for. Okay. But you're not thrilled with the benefits I'm hearing. Is this true? Um, I, I think the things that I'm looking for will come eventually, but right out of the gate, it's, it's going to be a little bit less than what I wanted, but I think the potential yeah. is definitely there. Yeah, and uh, I concur 100%. I just feel that um, you know, you're a little disappointed with the, maybe the money and the benefits or, or whatever, but that uh, you, know, you put the time in and then uh, a year goes by and then everything follows for you. Um, uh, are you teaching? No, I don't. No, I'm not a teacher. Instructing, teaching, I keep seeing this for you. Um, and human resources, this is wild. Okay, this is what I'm going to say to you, Marion. Um, you're going to take, uh, without a doubt, intuitively, I know you're going to take this job within the next two weeks. You have to give them an answer. But I do feel God's got something else in store for you. <laughs> All right? And out of the blue, out of left field, this opportunity is offered to you that you could do with your eyes closed because you're such a people person. God bless us all. All right, and right. you're the one. You're like the consigliere of all your friends. They're, oh, what do I do? How do I handle this? Everybody comes to you for advice, Marianne. Isn't this true? Yeah, I think so. Yes. Yeah, I know yeah. so. And so all that brilliance, and that's a gift you've been blessed with. And so there'll be an opportunity for you to utilize it in a corporate way. So uh, again, there'll be another choice, and I'll get another phone call in October, and it's okay. <laughs> All right, but for now, for this choice, I believe you're going to go move forward with it, and I think that it's very solid. But I don't think as fulfilling as you think it's going to be. Okay. So, okay. Um, and hence the the this uh, the universe presenting the second opportunity, the second choice um, uh, in the fall that will really blow your door, doors off and, and uh, have international travel involved with it. All right. Well, that makes me very happy. Yeah, I figured. So <laughs> it's like, you know, dream big, babe. You know, you're so gifted. You're so brilliant. You're so intelligent. You're the whole package, honey. You know, um, you're beautiful physically, I'm hearing, but you got the brains and the, um, the, the heart and soul to back it up. Wow. And uh, something Thank about, you. you know, like the world needs you, not just being stuck in one geographic location. Okay? Okay. All right, so uh, call me again. I know you will in the fall. <laughs> I'm even predicting your next phone call for you here. Um, I crack myself up sometimes. So it's, um, but I, I think in the next two weeks, this is a good go for you. It's a good start. It's a start, okay? All right, sounds great. Thank you so much. Oh, thanks for calling in. Lots of love, honey. Th Lots of thank blessings. Thank you so much. All right. Okie dokie. Bye. Lisa, Lisa, you are so generous to allow um, other people to have their questions answered, to have their energy soothed and satiated. And um, uh, you just, that's what I love about Scorpios, it's, <laughs> you just flow with it. And um, it shows in your work. Um, now, what is that uh, work behind you, uh, all the this is, um, colors? This is Jessica's soul portrait, and it has her, uh, notice her eyes. Hers is really, everybody really loves the eyes. And she's an avatar um, in a past life. And so that's what that shows. And she has a lot of love. And um, she works with children, so you wow. can't really see the hands. And then this, these are small uh, mythological paintings here, the Tree of Life. And then these are unicorns. So it's not just the soul portraits. It's other energy work that could be smaller for the people, uh, messages from, a, from above. And I also do heart link, which is uh, if someone has passed over, I could do a painting to link the two people from this side to the other side. Shut the front door, you do this? Shut the front door, yeah. Wow, okay, let's expand on that. Okay, expand well some on. people give me photographs, um, either the, the last moment they were with the person or um, a facial or something, so then I just go into a meditation and just kind of 
interpret what it is that they that they need in order to heal. So both parties are healing from on this side and the other side. Oh, that's wow! Wow. So you do a fusion between the energy that has uh, moved uh, moved on and that's still here. Because there's always a connection. I call it a heart link. Sure. So and then this is something that they can, it's tangible that they can look at. I love it. It's love, very love, nice. love it. Did I say that enough? I love, love, love that. I love, love doing and, it. And um, <laughs> this could be part of um, you know grief healing. It you is. know. Uh, we'll have to hook you up with uh, Mark Anthony. He's the uh, uh, the attorney. The this uh, he's been on my show, okay. and he does grief healing uh, all all it's all the place. Another form of healing, absolutely. Got, and he's a Scorpio. Love it. Just saying, <laughs> hey, we gotta hook you up. And what? What? Oh no no no! Not only one more minute. No, don't say it's not true. Um, okay, we have. Where's the, where's, the, where's the questions? Where's the questions? Come here to me. Everybody's saying hello, but I don't see questions. Hey, Tony. Hey, Tony. Tony and Margaret, I see you. Hello from Texas. Hi, Connie. Uh, Linda Diamore is saying hi to you and I, Lisa. Hi, Linda. Uh, Linda <laughs> Dinkelman. Hi, ladies. Hi, hi, hi. Everybody's telling everybody to ask a question. Nobody's asking a question. Oh, Lois, I have never seen such compassion as Grace, a perfect name. I love you, Lois. Okay, so. Oh, here we go. Shirley, Lewis, any messages for my children meeting their soulmates? Oh, Shirley, honey, that's, that's what I love is love. But unfortunately, we're at the end of the show here. It's like the cliffhanger. So um, you're going to need to call into my next show, which um, they'll be really wanting to uh, talk to uh, my guest, uh, Joost uh, Van Dyke, who's going to be my guest next month. And uh, we'll, uh, anybody with a question, you're not forgotten, we'll get to you. If we don't get to you during this show, we will get to you during the next live show. And um, please know you can contact Lisa through her website, lisafazioartist.com. And we got to wrap it up. She's awesome. She's the best.